I'm Beth. And I'm Chad Meeks. And Beth and I have been going to Vineyard since uh, 1999, and we've also been married for 15 years. Okay. We started dating in 94, and we dated for five years before we got engaged and got married. I knew that she was the one. We had taken it seriously, and when we got married, I was you know, positive that that was it. Everything was going to be happy and blissful. And I, and probably Beth will tell you the same, started living self-centered lives. Uh, I looked at the world and asked it, what could it do for me instead of what could I do for others? What could I do for my wife? And so eventually, um, you know, living self-centered lives is going to take a toll on the marriage, and it did. So in 2006, we found ourselves separated and um, looking at a divorce in our future, and it, it was a kick in the stomach. And never in a million years did I think that I was going to be divorced. God revealed to me that He did not want me to leave the marriage um, in the state it was in. He didn't want me to give up. That was hard because I didn't want to. I didn't want to be obedient. It was easier to give up. Beth was praying and calling out and getting a very specific message from God, whereas I was ignoring Him. And my best description is that I had to hit rock bottom. And when I hit there, that's when I prayed to God. I, uh, you know, I just said to Him, "Hey, I don't know my way out of here." And shortly after that, I started talking to Beth again and showing my interest of working things out, not knowing that she had had this specific message from God that as long as we were still married, she was going to work on it. I'm still stunned sometimes by what God did in our life. Um, if you had told me in 2006 that we would still be married in 2015, I would have told you you were crazy. We still have our imperfections, our faults, our arguments like every other couple, uh, but they, they last a lot shorter and we forgive a lot quicker because we, we know where we've been before and God brought us back.